Hey guys, this is Axel here, and welcome back to a brand new episode of Until Dawn. Now, where we left off, a lot of moose, pack of moose, and Mike got his fingers chopped off, which is um a good a good time. Uh, Mike's exploring the sanatorium, and Matt and Emily are trying to find help, and Sam's still in the tub. So let's see what happens to her. <laughs> She's just enjoying music. She's having a good time. I actually saw a footage of Until Dawn, it's like pre-alpha phase back in 2012. And when they showed parts of the game, this was like the first scene they showed. Hello? Guys? Oh, this chapter, this part of the chapter. They showed what it. What are you doing out there? Totally different actor Creepy. back then. But I'm glad they got Hayden Penetier. Okay. Not that I'm saying that the other actor was probably bad. It's just that you can't go wrong with Hayden. Nice. Sam's in the towel. Pete's sakes, my clothes, really? Whichever one of you did this is off my Christmas list. Seriously, not cool, guys. Not cool at all. He only left a single sock. You know what that means. Stocking for Christmas. Obviously. In the original Until Dawn footage, like back in 2012 with the different actor, you can see, like, Sam's character Chris? in the nude for a second. Josh? And, of course, they changed it so that you don't see Sam in the nude because, you know, it's Hayden Panettiere's body. And I don't think she'd agree to that. Or maybe she would. I don't know. Depends. Some actors aren't comfortable with, like, having their body shown in, like, a video game. <laughs> Full body. Because I know uh, in Beyond Two Souls, uh, Ellen Page or Elliot Page's Mike, sorry, Emily? Elliot Page's uh, body this was is really getting out of hand. Okay, it was all very funny. Ha ha! Look at Sam walking around in a towel. But now I just really want this to be over. All right? You had enough? No, I don't think they have. But Elliot Page's uh, body was leaked on Detroit Become Human because they modeled her entire body. And, uh, I think she, like, I think she, like, got mad at the developers for that. Can I have my clothes back now, or am I supposed to hang out in a towel for the rest oh, of the Oh, she day? got mad at the people that leaked the camera. Towel it is, then. But either way, like, there was a big controversy going on because, like, her full body was in the game. Like, nude and, and nudity and everything, and, uh... She wasn't happy. Also, there was a balloon that flew away. I don't know if it flows away now, but there was a balloon around here that flew. Oh, there it is. Flows right away when you walk by it. So, so some actors may not be fine with uh, their body being shown in in games. Uh, maybe like if you ask them, they'll probably be fine with it. But like. In Beyond Two Souls, I don't think they asked Elliot. Because n nobody was supposed to see it. What do you have here? Circular saw, replacement blades. Nice. Okay, if you were trying to freak me out, guess what? You succeeded. I don't think they're trying to freak her out. Maybe they're trying to freak her out. But maybe... Maybe they just changed it so that Sam's body isn't shown in the game. Nice. Okay. I love that this is like a magic towel. It just doesn't fall off. In the kitchen, cooking something up. 
<laughs> like this this is a magic towel does it i think it has like a gold embroidery with the w on the bottom so maybe it's like a really expensive towel that like has technology that wraps around your body and d prevents it from getting off you maybe i don't know probably not you never know somebody in the world would probably make a tower like that and then just like advertise it with like technology oh, guys wow this is weird hey never in my life has a towel on. stayed up on me without me this, having to really constantly pull it up Looking for me? I don't think you'll have much luck by looking, Samantha. You're only going to see what I want you to see. And I have quite a lot to show you. What is going on? Open your eyes. Oh my Creepy. God. She's quite beautiful, isn't she? Why are you doing out A beautiful bathing bird. Do you think she has any idea what lies ahead? Do you think these were the last happy moments of this creature's life? Showing this to me. Why are you watching? Josh! How does it make you feel? Oh my God, what did you do? I'm going to give you ten uh -oh. seconds. Nine. Eight. Now she's caught up uh, all up to speed. Oh, I don't want that needle. Can you put that away, please? Um, his hand went through the camera. Take that. I don't want a needle. I'm an adult. I don't need a flu shot. Just kidding. Um, let's hide. No, he's probably gonna see me. Let's go for it. Hey, at least I made him waste time by kneeling down. Strategies. Um, let's hide. I don't want the shot. Going for it. No! 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 no. Whack! Got gotcha, you, son. Right in the face. Are you kidding me? No handle. You already knew this. Pull it down. Oh, the needle. No. I don't want the HPV shot. Boom. He's coming at me with the vaccination. I don't need no needles. Not for me. And let me hide again. Maybe it might work this time. Oh, fuck. 
Would you just call me? He's very upset because he just wanted to show me his drugs. And to be honest, I didn't want any. Last time I checked, I didn't pay for it. I didn't offer. He didn't offer. He just well, wanted to give me some. Didn't go according to plan. Now, did it? Sure it did. Such careful, brilliant plotting, and yet in a crucial moment, you are foiled by your own inadequacies. I told you, everything you do has consequences. Well, if a man comes in with a needle, I'm just going to run away from it. What do you do, and what do you say, causes things to change? Yes. Oh, the good work. It did, exploring the source of your fear. And you've just gone and used it for ill. Mm-hmm. Your overwhelming fear of isolation. You have turned it against these people who use it desperately want to torment. Has it been worth it? The camera just went through something. I saw that. The camera's been going through a couple things. The game isn't perfect. <laughs> what? Okay, previously on, but we can skip this. Alright, and we're back to psychosis. With some moose. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? I'm gonna show them my moves. Dance off. Stay calm. Relax. They're just deer. I just wanna check us out as all. No, 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 Matt. They're gonna hurt us. Dang. Sam is escaping from somebody trying to give her free drugs and. Matt is just dealing with some moose. Well, Matt and Emily. Can't exclude Emily. And Mike is going to a mental hospital. Crazy turn of events. I'm not gonna hit the moose. Just walk slow. It's okay. Come on. It's okay. If we do manage to get someone on the radio, we will. then we tell them we need help. What do we do while we wait? We go back to the lodge and get everyone else. Oh god, not the lodge. We should stay here in case whoever it is needs to get back in touch with us. Let's get that radio. Matt, you okay? I just saw that. You did a little twirly. Motion sensor, probably. What the heck was that sound? I heard more than just... I heard, like, breathing all around my ear. Oh, yeah, it's a motion light. When you go near it, it just turns off. Totam. Or when you go away from it, it turns off. Guidance to him. He put the gun down. Matt, Emily, both of us are gonna survive this, I'm sure of it. She has a, like, massive light. Come up here, Matt. Don't. You like the view, Matt? You like the view? Yeah, don't, don't look at it. That's what I thought, Matt. Show some respect. No! Don't look! That's what I thought. 
disrespectful. Why would he do that? I mean, I'm sure he could come up here with the axe. He probably thought, like, oh, we probably don't need it. But you'll probably need it. You just, like, encountered a bunch of moose Why is it so windy all slash the deer. We're almost inside. This way. Yeah, there we go. Boop! Boop! Raising the roof. Wait. There we go. Her light was a little twitching a little there when I was grabbing it. So I thought she wasn't holding it for a second there. But she was. Nice. Good job. Boop. So, no power. Oh, come on. Great. No power. <laughs> I love how she has to point out the fact that there's no power twice. Hey, Matt, by the way, there's no power. Wait, there's a full on sink? I just realized that. There's a full on sink over here. How would a how would water line get all the way up here? Unless they use like a thing they put on like the roof that collects water. They might have done that. Okay, I know the uh, flare is back here. Or maybe I went the long way around. I did. Oops. Boop. Give the flare gun to Matt. Yep. Here you go. You take this, might need it. Aye, aye, Captain. Recognize this from a totem. Therefore, we did good. Fuse box. It would be pretty cool if they actually had a water line going all the way up here on top of this tower. I mean, they might. There's a lot of ropes and stuff. So it might be a water thing somewhere. It's alive! Beth. Yeah. There's also this locker here. That's true. That's true. Have you seen this person? Open up in a bow. Okay. Boop. You know with this, you're supposed to like rotate it clockwise. But if you rotate it counterclockwise, it goes this way. And a part of me, like, when I first discovered this, I was like, oh, there might be a secret message if you, like, mess with the audio of this. There might be, but I haven't found anything. But why would they let you be able to put it this way if there's, like, nothing to do with it? That's what I was thinking. I was thinking, since, since you can do it, there's probably something to do with it. Whether the audio is you know, an easter egg or something, or something happens if you keep it like this, I don't know. That's what I thought a couple years ago when I first discovered it. 
So if you all can find anything, do let me know. Boop. Hello? Anyone there? Hello? Please say something if you're out there. Please, we need help. Over, over. Shit. Hello? Oh my god. Thank god. We need help. Please. Hello? Is someone trying to contact us? This is the Park Ranger Service for Blackwood County. We're not getting your signal very well. Please speak slowly and clearly. Over. Please. Please, please, please help. Oh my god. We're stuck on Blackwood Mountain. And there's a maniac. Just help us, please. We need help. We need assistance. Okay, my name is Emily. This is my name is Emily. Aren't you supposed to hold down the button when you speak? Or is it like some of them you just have to press it? Uh, we're up on the mountain. We're on Blackwood Mountain by the ski lodge. There's a killer and he's after us and he's already so much. Oh, oh yeah, she is holding it in right now when she's speaking. Yeah, you can hear the button being pressed. That's on fire, too. Emily. No. Uh, maybe later. <laughs> I think the radio just said, go F yourself over. That's what I heard, anyways. <laughs> oh! Got this, Matty boy. Damn it! Calling me an idiot? You're gonna be fine, 69%? Nice. What's your problem? You know what, this isn't the best time to do it, but she called me an idiot. I'm gonna be all defensive. What the fuck is your problem? I... what? Why are you being such a bitch to me? I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean it, really. I deserve better. Dang, he's... He, you can go straight for it. I mean, she just straight up apologized, she didn't mean it. So, like, you, you can be calm now, but, like, somebody, you could just really lay into her. I'm gonna try and get to you and pull you up. Now, will you 
please get me off this goddamn tower. Please, 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 Matt, just do something. I'm gonna save you. I got you. I got you, Emily. Here. I don't want to tip it. I'm say oh wow, not many people saved her. But I'm doing it. I'm saving her. I'm saving her life. Dang. There goes his leather jacket. His jersey. Emily's gone, man. You gotta move on. Find new people. Me. Oh. Oh yeah, got the flare. Going down. Whew. He's good. And that concludes this episode of Until Dawn. Now, this recording session was about an hour to an hour and a half long. Instead of making a video that long, I decided to cut it in half. So that's why I'm doing this outro now instead of in the video like I usually do. Thank you everybody for watching. If today's your birthday, happy birthday. If you sneezed on this video, bless you. If you had a bad day, I truly hope this helped cheer you up in some way. This episode was really, really intense, so I hope you enjoyed it. And yeah, see you tomorrow, everybody.